Hi there, my friends. This is Ashton Blake, and I want to talk about Facebook as a free traffic source and what I really think about it. So stay tuned. Okay, let's talk about Facebook as it relates to free traffic. Now, there's a lot of things that need to be addressed with this, and I don't see too many YouTubers talk about this. But I want to go into the negatives before I go into the positives. So, for example, we have your um, typical posts where you're promoting an affiliate offer like Joshua Elder 0 to 10K Challenge. You get your high engagements so of people are interested in the offer, but you also get a lot of these spam posts or Telegram, group chat, everywhere around these Facebook groups. And it's very little you can do to stop them. And, you know, like, 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 you can try to hide these comments, report them or so, but they keep on coming back. And the admins in many of these groups don't look like they just don't care at all. And even Facebook don't do nothing about it. And, you know, like, like, it's, it's pretty much everywhere. And, and, and you also have these same scammers that going, like, they'll spam your inbox with a bunch of junk. They try to attempt to get your information, even take over your account. And there's a lot of that going on in, in this Facebook group. And it's not just the scams you find in many of these Facebook groups, but the random piece of content that have nothing to do with the topic of what this group is all about. Like affiliate marketing worldwide, for example. Um, even though a post like this could be about affiliate marketing, somebody drawing to an offer, I'm getting them to do a private message inbox. There's other posts on here that have nothing to do with affiliate marketing. Like you see here with construction, uh, relationships, nothing to do with this. You know, funding and, you know, like, like where's the ClickBank offers? Where's the Warrior Plus, JVZoo? Like you saw, see something about horror. Like, what the hell? Like all these random pieces of content as a waste of time. It's a bunch of time wasters to distract people. To grab your attention. <laughs> and you know what else is going to probably grab your attention? <laughs> that nothing to do with affiliate marketing. This is porn. You know, obviously, the, um, it's blurred out for, you know, you know, viewer purposes. But still, this is ridiculous. You have porn on here. And it's right before you see anything about ClickBank. Finally, a post about ClickBank. <laughs> After scrolling down this Facebook group, that's about affiliate marketing worldwide. None of that is addressed in this group at all. You know, just, you know, what it needs to be, like, there need to be more groups where, like, it's private and it's more on topic. Like, like um, the admin that need to be on point. And many of these admins, as you see in many of these groups, none of them are on point whatsoever. You just see a bunch of random content and nothing to do with affiliate marketing and like very few posts on, 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 on the stuff that's on topic. As you can see here. Now the ClickBank Super Affiliates group is the closest to what I'm talking about in terms of being on topic. It's good that it's private, which means that, you know, you can pre-qualify which person you can come in. Making sure that the person's not a uh, spammer of some sort or making random videos or, you know, porn or any of that crap. So even though this group is not perfect, they still got some of those Telegram um, spams on there, but it's mostly about affiliate marketing. As you can see here, like the first thing you see is ClickBank, um, affiliate marketing tutorial. Now, it, yeah, you know, there's some things here and there about traffic. Yeah, like I said, like there's some some Telegram scams on here, but um, it's mostly about affiliate marketing, which is what the group should be about. Like, you know what I mean? If there's a group about e-commerce, it should be all about e-commerce. If there's a group about Bitcoin, it should be all about Bitcoin. And, you know, there's not a lot of those groups that are like that, that, you know, be on topic and admin that actually cares. <laughs> So, you know, um, and there's one other scam on here that I've been seeing in many of these groups that I highly recommend that you don't do. And sell, like selling your ClickBank account when it's free. 
But yeah, I know, right? Like, uh, why when it's free? <laughs> so it's crazy. So what's good about Facebook traffic, despite some of the negatives, you can make highly engaging posts like this. You get a lot of comments of people are interested in your offer. And I made some sales as a result of this. Especially a guy like this that's interested in this offer. <laughs> It says, um, a funny gift. It says, you better show me. You better show me. <laughs> and unfortunately, you will also get some comments on here, the Telegram scams. I mean, it is what it is. But as long as you find people that are interested, you know, it doesn't really matter. So, like, um, you can always hide those comments. But, you know, another thing that's really important when it comes to Facebook traffic, matter of fact, we go to discussions this loads up okay is the ranks so you so so um even as a new member you get a ranks like these or you know um visual storyteller or your know, conversation starter and all those ranks are all about you your engagement within a group or anybody's post or so and now uh, facebook algorithm will pick that up and can also get more traffic that way so you know if you want to get tra traffic to your posts um, like you definitely do that definitely um, it's always encouraged like comment on other people's posts look at other people's posts depending on what you do like Facebook will pick that up like um, let me show you a good example of that uh, like this guy here he's a rising star he's been creating a lot of engagement posts within his first month of this clickbank group and he's getting like uh, 100 comments of a lot of people and fully engage within this group. So it's really important to do that too. You know, and that really is a golden nugget to the Facebook traffic. And also, if you see any posts of anybody that they're having trouble um, making their first commissions or so, you can definitely um, go to that person's name, reach, reach out to them by inboxing them, and then pitch your offer from right there. Or you can search for new members and you know like I to go for members that have common things with you like somebody um, um, people who have the same friends as you or you can go for completely new members who are just who just joined the Facebook group and promote to them so there's so many ways you can promote on Facebook but but the one thing you got to know about Facebook it's all about engagement so, you know, definitely consider that one right there when it comes to the free traffic on Facebook. So without further ado, that's about it for the end of this video. Thank you very much for watching this video. And I hope you got a ton of value from learning about the pros and cons of the Facebook traffic. Now, if you're interested in joining the program, check out my recent video on the multiple income funnel. Now, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. And stay tuned.